Christmas break can be a challenge for kids with weakened immune systems, but the Children's Healing Center is providing a safe place to play. Joining me now, we have Associate Director Melissa Block on the couch. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having me. Of course. Well, the Children's Healing Center is such a, a valuable resource in our community. Mm -hmm. Just tell us how it got started sure. and who you're aiming to help with it. Yeah, so the center was started about four and a half years ago by mm -hmm. Amanda Barber, who went through a cancer journey herself in mm -hmm. her early 20s. Um, she was uh, meeting a lot of families that lives were changed due to a serious uh, illness diagnosis, right. and she really wanted to do something to help. So here we are today, and we serve families who have a child vulnerable to illness, mm -hmm. um, and the child has to be aged zero to 26 in order to qualify, okay. and then the entire family can come and participate in our programs. I love this. So the kids are not held back at all by any right. conditions or illnesses they might be facing, and not only uh, the, the kids involved, but also their siblings mm -hmm. can also participate and have fun as well. Let's talk about uh, what's happening during the holiday break. You guys have many fun-filled themed days I do, <laughs> we do. So our uh, holiday break camps are all H themed this year. Okay. Um, so next week we're kicking it off with a Harry Potter day where the kids will get to dive into the wizardi wizarding world of yeah. Harry Potter. Uh, That's we're doing, gonna be fun. It's gonna be really fun. <laughs> we're going to do a going hunting uh, day on Thursday where mm -hmm. they're going to learn about hunting and fishing and um, have a lot of fun learning yeah. about all the aspects of that. And then we're gonna round off next week with a hot and cold with a lot of science experiments mm -hmm. um, and learning about the differences between hot and cold. Mm -hmm. And then the following week, we're going to have a happy new year, which I think is going to be my favorite day. We're going to yeah. do a ball drop and have the kids do all. Kind of earlier on the day That's so the right. kids get that experience. Yep, for okay. those younger kids. <laughs> um, and then Thursday is going to be a home improvement theme with Home Depot projects and okay. learning about building and projects. And then we're going to end camps with our hearts and hands day. And that's really about positive, um, positive self-talk, gratitude, giving back to others. Um, yeah. and all things surrounding that. That's so important too. Yeah. Uh, tell me why, why did you feel the need to create these camps uh, to kind of give kids something to do? Sure. So they can be just normal and have fun. Right, so for our kids, uh, traditional camp experiences isn't possible yeah. due to their conditions. They're, right. they're vulnerable to illness. Their families are really work hard to protect them mm -hmm. um, and keep them healthy. So we are busiest when school's out and we yeah. host these camps so the kids can come in and really participate in life like kids, um, like their peers who are not going through the right. medical journeys that they are. Absolutely. So how can people get involved? Do you need to sign up for these uh, day camps yeah, ahead we, of time? We or? do ask for RSVPs and those go to uh, Deb Wynn, who's our program manager. Okay. Um, and she can be reached at dwin at childrenshealingcenter.org. Okay. Um, and yeah, we, we love doing this and it's a lot of fun. It's really busy. It's going to yeah. be a good week. Good All right. two weeks. It's, you guys have some great themes picked out yeah. this uh, year. Yeah. Uh, where can people learn more about the Children's Healing Center uh, if they're not able to mm -hmm. attend the camp but still want to in the future? Certainly, it's www.childrenshealingcenter.org. Okay, amazing work that you guys do in Thank the community. You. Thank you so much for being here, Melissa. Appreciate, Appreciate it. it.